Hi, welcome. So for today's video, I am going to teach you how to send out broadcasts and how important it is for your page. So let's All right, so your first step again is to go to the bots menu page and I'll just click this button. Now on the left corner, you will see the broadcasts. Okay, so now why do we actually have to use broadcast? So this tool is actually very helpful since it allows you to mass message your audience or narrow down a specific target customers you want to send your message to. So in this case, you will be sure that you are sending the right message at the right person and at the right time. Now, as you can see, we have four sections here. First is the drafts or the messages or flaw that you had started that haven't scheduled yet. Say, for example, this is an incomplete flow, or you're still waiting for the perfect opportunity to send out the message. Next is the scheduled part, or the messages that are yet to be sent out. So these are the complete flows with schedule that you had set maybe tomorrow or next week or whatever your strategy is. Next is the sending or the messages that are currently in progress of being delivered. So it's real time. You can see the progress here. And lastly, the history. So these are the messages that you previously sent out. So you can also see the stocks here versus the send or the number of audience your message had, had reached. Next says read or how many actually opened the message and clicks or those who interacted with your bot. So this part right here is very important in analyzing what strategy you should apply in your next broadcast. So you really have to brainstorm, like does it have to be the same or should you use more appealing message? It's up to you. Right now, let's try adding our new broadcast. Okay, so here you can either announce a new product or say you're going on a sale or there are new promos, whatever your strategy is. So now I'm going to use a promo broadcast and you just have to edit your flow as usual. So conversation. Right. Okay, so I'll just going to edit this one depending on my promo so you can do the same okay so now you'll see i already edited my promo i asked them to choose any of the colors below and they will instantly receive a free gift so let's see what i did next as you can see i added more blocks so this connects to the color of the promo that they had chosen so let's try this blue one Okay, so in here I added congratulations. They have received a $10 off on their next purchase. And I also asked them to confirm their email so they can receive the promo details. All right, so here. And save again. All right, so at the end, I just added a quick thank you for confirming their email. So next for the settings. Okay, so now we'll see the settings. Here in the targeting, you can set which audience should receive your message. So as indicated here, only users that match all of the following conditions will receive the message. So as you can see, I have seven uh, users now or followers. So it's, it's only seven because it's just a trial page, but I will show you how to narrow down your audience. So for the condition, you'll add, for example, I want is I want only female to receive this uh, promo because this is a bug promo. As you can see, it has been narrowed down to just four users, meaning I only have four female followers. And you can set other conditions depending on what you want. So for now, I'll just use this one. Next is the message type or the subscription message. This is the default one. And next, the segment. So this area right here is only available for, for pro version users. So this is to avoid spamming. So you can limit the number of message that will be sent out every minute. So for example, I want to send from subscriber number one to four. 
over 100. For example, you have over 100. It depends on your page, even thousands. So for me, I want to send out uh, two messages, for example, or you can set that to 20, 50. And for the scheduled broadcast, uh, you can either start sending now right away or you can uh, schedule for later. I will show you how first. So here you will see you can select the date and the repeat time, how many times you want to send the message. So for now, let's try to start sending the message now and schedule message. So you just uh, scheduled your message. You see it has been... Uh, in the sending area, sending section right here because it's already being sent out. So as of now, there are already four people and there there's a one audience that had already sent the message. So there, you can monitor it real time. So now you already know how to send out your broadcast. So you have to use it wisely. You have to strategize or brainstorm, which is the best at time and the right message to send your audience. And if you have any more questions, check out the other tutorial videos and see ya.